Ah, the gorgeous Vector Strix RTX RGB. Wait. RGB? What year is this? 2015? Uh, no, 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 no. You don't get us. DRGB is the real deal. Get it? It even starts with a D for deal. Yeah. In this tutorial, we will show you how to upgrade your EK Vector Strix RTX GPU block with DRGB Lightning. In order to do that, we have to detach the existing kit that comes in three pieces. For the first one, we don't need any tools, so just pop it up as shown here. To remove the second piece, we need an Allen key that comes in a package with your Vector GPU water block. Unscrew these two screws and remove the second piece. Use the same Allen key to remove the first screw of the third piece. For the second screw, we need to use this mini spanner. Just look at it, so cute. In the DRGB upgrade kit package, you will find two LED strips. Go for the longer one, remove 3M protective film, and install it as showcased here. Now take the shorter one, remove the film, and gently place it inside this piece. Put the piece back to the GPU water block and tighten the screws up. Now place this piece onto the proper spots. Tighten the first screw with an Allen key, and as for the second one, just use your fingers to make it quick, and finish it off with the spanner. The third element already comes with a pre-installed DRGB lightning, so just pop it back in place. Now take the DRGB power cable from the upgrade kit box in order to connect all the elements together. Connect this header to this DRGB element. It's the most distant one from the 3-pin 5-volt power connector. Don't worry, it can only go one way through. Now connect the second one to the element that has Vector Strix written on it. It's the closest one to the 3-pin connector. Lastly, connect the female header from the GeForce RTX DRGB element with the only one remaining. Bye bye! Ah, just kidding, we know you came for the light show. Hit it! Yeah, that's what we're talking about. 